Hello, this is Marvin McKenzie, and I wanted to uh, spend a few minutes and uh, show you a process that I went through uh, yesterday in order to make uh, some postcard invitations for the church that I pastor, Bible Baptist Church in Puyallup, Washington. And I've made these postcard invitations and had them printed up before, uh, actually from a company called Got Print. And But um, two things have changed since the last order that I made. Actually, I found a mistake in the order, so I wanted to correct it. And uh, But the two things that have changed, or the, the things that changed, I found a mistake I wanted to correct. And then I've switched to from a PC to a, a Mac uh, computer uh, since, since the last time that I created these. And so it kind of put me in a whole new learning curve. And to be honest, it took me the better part of yesterday uh, to make these postcards and so I thought I would just go through and make a video on the process that I went through to be able to find it. Now it took me a long time to decide and tr tried several different programs and apps on my MacBook Pro to be able to do it. I finally just uh, settled in with using my using pages and I created this page that you can see here from pages. That's the front. Um, let me see if I can drop this down, maybe get a little bit better look at it. Yeah, there we go. File, open, show you the other one. I don't know what happened there. Okay, yeah, so here's the back page of it. And then, of course, I just showed you the front page a second ago. So I'll turn back to it here real quick. So I made these two actually using pages, and it, there was a little bit of a learning curve to be able to use that. All of the pictures on this page uh, are mine, and, um, and graphics and things that I created uh, are all um, things that I did and created this. The problem that I had, now, um, the problem that I had was the size. This is, uh, I couldn't figure out how on pages, and if you know a way, I'd be glad to hear I couldn't figure out how on pages to, to get this to be the size that I wanted it to be. Um, it would only allow me to have two different uh, size options and both of them were really about the same size uh, as a, a regular paper. Now um, I used the program, that, the, 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 um, the website that I used to print these is a new one for me and it's called uh, Print Place and I just thought I'd show you that. I found it on Dubly. I decided to use it because um, Dubly offers uh, a cashback incentive, a cashback uh, rebate for using it. And so I just decided that I would look and see what I could do from, uh, from Dubly and to see if they had someone. So all I did is I just typed in print and I actually found a place called Print Place. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and, and show that to you. I decided I'd go ahead and, and, sh and go there through Dubly to show you just how, how it easy it is to do. My computer's running just a little bit slow because I'm also uploading a, a, um, a video right now as, as this is going on. Notice this, though, what I've got here, 9.2% cash back rebate for using it. So it made it use, made it worthwhile, and, and actually it worked out that the price is going to be, it was, was just slightly less than I paid uh, for them with Got Print, and so it worked out uh, real well for me to, to do it this way. But I went to Print Place, and, uh, and from there, uh, made the order. And now these postcard invitations that I make are, they're actually four by six. But when you print them, you have to make them a little bit larger than that for it to be able to work out. Um, you know, so on there, you know, they have some, some printing requirements that you have to use. And so um, I had to work within those parameters of that. And, and what I learned uh, from when I, this is going to take a second here, I guess. What I learned from the uh, from this is that really what I needed was I needed the postcard size to be five by seven, in order for it to be able to uh, to to meet their requirements for the four by six because they want some uh, some bleed through. They want some some extra where they can trim and cut. And here's the site print place and um, look at this. I found so many things you can actually order. Uh, have uh, design a an invitation and have them mail it out for you. You tell them the zip code and the neighborhood you want them to mail it out. And uh, I think I'll probably try that in uh, in a little while, not today, but in sometime in the future I'll probably try this out. Anyway, so what I did is I went back to pages and I've got it now. I've got this thing and I've got the front and back side 
and I've got to get that down to five by seven. That's what I've got to I've got to figure out how to do that. And I did notice on print place, place um, I, it they accept a PDF, and I can send out. I can I can save this as a PDF. So what I did is I saved it as a PDF, and I saved it as the uh, best format that I could. I saved it as a PDF. I'm going to go ahead and save it all again. It's this screen is in the way. I've got to move that up there. Yeah, that'll help me out. All right, so I save it as a PDF. Now, uh, now I've got it in my. Uh, I know where it is. It's in uh, um, Dropbox as a PDF. So I just come in. That's where I, I chose to save it there. Looking for you. Front. Now, when I click on that PDF, it's going to come up in Viewer, and then I, when I get ready, I'm going to export as a PDF again. I'm going to export it this time into Downloads. Only here for Show Details, I can tell it I want to make it set five by seven. Now it's going to take this whole page and it's going to print, it's going to create this entire page, but it, pr it creates it as a five by seven PDF. And I can take that now, go back to, to, uh, um, to print place. And I've already done this here, but, uh, done it, but I can go from there and make my order, order my, uh, postcards comes right over here. I think it is where it says, uh, postcards. I can order my post postcard and then it gives me a place to drop in to just drop in that uh, that page and it's really that simple. Took me a long time but I did have to figure that out that I can use the preview, the PDF preview to make it a different size. I don't notice that it didn't give me any custom sizes. It was um, there were some preset sizes but I was able to to do use it that way and um, and make my postcard invitations for our church. I'm Marvin McKenzie. I'm the pastor of Bible Baptist Church in Puyallup, Washington. You can find me on the web at www.puyallupbaptistchurch.com. Also, if you'll look down uh, underneath this video, you'll see all kinds of links to the various other uh, content that I have created. Thank you for watching.